Hi guys and welcome to day 176. Can't tell you a lot today because uh, we've misplaced Charlie's school, home school book, unfortunately. Um, so we weren't able to send it in this morning. We will find it, hunt it out, send it with him tomorrow, hopefully, so we'll be able to catch you guys up on what he's been doing. But he did bring home some lovely pictures. There's that one there. And that one there, so they're awesome. Um, and they will be going <coughs> on the wall, so yes, that's pretty cool. Um, yeah, he's come home, he's all smiley, happy. I love it when he's in that mood. And you know, today feels like a better day. I think definitely Poppy's on the mend. Um, she's she's still a little bit whingy and whatever else, but that's to be expected, so that you know, that's fair enough. I did manage to get some sleep last night, so that's helped a lot, uh, and that's raised my mood ever so slightly so that's that's all good and yeah I say I can't tell you a lot Charlie's been off a bit with his breakfast um today uh, and actually over the past couple of days he will eat it but it's just taken him a lot longer and he's normally as you guys know they're wanting it so what we've done is we've switched to like his favourite flavour in hopes uh, you know maybe he's sort of protesting us or telling us he doesn't like that okay you know people could say maybe he's getting sick of it he probably is, but um, Charlie won't eat toast, you know, he won't eat cereals and things like that. Porridge is something we know he'll definitely eat. Um, so we've had to just stick with it and hopefully he will either find something else that he likes or carry on eating porridge because... Right, excuse me, I'm uh, loaded with a bit of cold, but... Yeah, uh, it's porridge. So you can either do that or, you know get into it because there's no way we can let him out of the house without eating anything it's a long day for him um especially you know this school being 20 miles away <laughs> so he's traveling there and back as well you know i can't do him without any breakfast so yeah that's something to look into maybe um and see what the best action is there if buying his favorite flavor doesn't sort of bring him back around to the idea so yes but it's just uh you know i always say blip it's not even a blip really it's just something we need to take into consideration <laughs> But it's so minor, um, considering Charlie's progress and stuff. I have no issues with that. Um, it's just a little thing, another little hurdle that we'll, uh, we'll find a way over, one way or another. So, yes, I say I can't tell you a lot, but I'll um, I'll shoot off, guys, because uh, I don't have his book. But, yes, just before I go, I want, you know, a, a thank you again. We're like one week now of six months which just to say that just sounds insane um to do this every day for six months like yeah it just um it, it blows my mind and it's extraordinary and all the help and support we've had's just been incredible um so sincerely 100 percent, thank you all um and we're about to hit 2000 likes on our page awesome and um, so if you guys haven't already if you want to go over to year in the life of autism give us a thumbs up that'd be cool and also, if you want to hit subscribe and help us out that way, that also would be awesome. Uh, and if not, whatevs, you know, it doesn't matter. Um, we just appreciate you guys taking time to watch and read and take an interest in our amazing son's incredible journey, um, which we love to share with you guys, you know, cause, you know, we're super proud parents. So thanks for watching, guys. As always, take care and let's have a look.